At last, Nigeria divides as a truckload of ammunition heading for Cross River is intercepted. I greet you good morning, my dear listeners in the house. It's a very pleasant day. On this very faithful day, we will be sensitizing you on realities that are already on ground. I tell you that this very broadcast is what is currently in vogue right now and is seriously causing tension in Nigeria as we speak. A truck loaded with ammunition heading to Cross River State was intercepted. Now the question is this. This truckload of ammunition, who are the people that ordered for it? And is it escorted by the military or an ordinary individual? This content will surely reveal it to you. This is morning news. Troops of 13th Brigade operating under command of 82 Division Nigerian Army on Tuesday, 21st June 2022, intercepted a Toyota's Camry car with number plate JAL 492AA, loaded with assorted ammunition while applying Otanga Village, heading for Opudu Mountain in Cross River State. The Nigerian security operative deployed at forward operating base Amana on duty on Tuesday, 21st June 2022, saddled with the responsibility of checking vehicles at their checkpoints, saw an incoming Toyota Camry car made frantically effort to stop it to check its content of his car. But the driver drove off at top speed to run away from them. This act made the operatives to open fire at him, which led to the bust of his tire and crippled his plans. While conducting a search on the car, the following destructive devices were found. In his car, 72 improvised explosive devices chargers, 200 rounds of 7.62 mm. NATO 121 dynamite liquid and 82 rounds of 7.62 mm special ammunition. All the materials recovered from the interceptor car are military uniforms and kits. The spokesman is the Army Force. Brigadier General Onyema Mwachuku advised well meaning Nigerians to give relevant information that will help to fish out all the criminal elements in the society. Hmm. Nigeria, 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 Nigeria. You see, this is where we are having a problem in this country. We are no longer safe. We are no longer safe in this country. Nigeria as said by this uh, music artist Idris Abdukerim Jaga Jaga, it's true. Look at, can you tell me where is this very ammunition going to? Who have ordered it? If not for our politicians, if not for the criminal youth, who have decided to be disguising as military officers in order to be invading people's home? Who have decided to take kidnapping as a duty? My dear listeners, not until our leaders begin to show good example, the youth will not change. I want to tell you without any missing word, that this um, ammunition that are discovered by this criminal female is being shipped to robbers, people who are uh, 
who, who, who we know to be those going about kidnapping and killing innocent people. Do you understand? So there is no hiding about this. Nigeria don't jaga jaga finish. I just have to tell you the truth. And uh, if you decide to give it a trace, you will see that it is someone on the top, someone in government that is sponsoring the incoming of these devices. How can such a device be allowed to be shipped into the country? How can such a device be allowed to be passing through the, the, the public road? How? Imagine, even when the security tried to stop him, he put his car on a high speed in order not to, to be caught. Thank God they, 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 they caught him. Sometimes I ask myself, these idiots called uh, the bandits, how are they getting the ammunition that they are using? If not for, for, for this for this means. Someone said something one time ago that these bandits sometimes when they come for attack, they come with military uniforms. You can now see. They go with military uniforms. So that is a problem. I don't know where we are heading to. Alright. No wahala. Thank God he was caught. Thank God he was exposed. Thank God he never succeeded in going away with this with this ammunition. If our security can be this tight and very solid, these criminals will no longer be succeeding in their evil doings. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I chose the truth. So, my people, let us be realistic in our doings and God will help us. Okay, let me know what's your take and opinion on this very broadcast maybe don't forget your comments are 100 percent needed don't forget to leave them below the comment section click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you